there you go so load showing off even though if we go into load output I don't know how to do this let's switch it to on okay green tick load is now set to on but it stays as off no, don't know how to do that anyway there is the charger load is off there's a light bulb here but I can make that correct itself if I unplug the solar which is outside there you go and it's the apple have shown why is the charger off because I've disconnected the solar and then if I reconnect the solar Way the load comes on, the load's on. Let's try switching it off in the app now. Load output always on, go to always off. Okay, there you go, it works again now. Go always on, okay. And it hasn't worked this time, it's still saying off. It might come on with a delay, or it might completely lock up if you select one of the other algorithms it always locks it up it's not battery load output that's always on and it's ticked let's try always off and then back on again Go on no nope, still showing us off and it's still off and again the way I can always get it to switch is either by resetting the charger completely or just unplug the solar input that's not the battery input that's solar Reconnect it. Oh, there you go, the load comes back on. It's definitely buggered. Another example, we've got the 12.9 volts. If I go in and the load is off, you can see there's no light on. Um, and if you look in the app, the load is off. 12.9, 4 volts and climbing because it's charging. So let's go into load output. I can't stop this LED flickering. And then I'll go to user defined algorithm one, which is on at 12.8 volts, off at 12.6. It's accepted it, but unsurprisingly, the load is not on, it's still off in the app, even though it's 12.9 volts. But you can wait two minutes, as they say. We could do the two minutes, in fact, we will. I'll pause this video and we'll come back. Right, so we're two minutes in, and still it's off, and nothing's happened, even though it should have switched on ages ago. And it won't. Let me try cycling the solar panel again. See if that makes it come on. So solar off. The power's definitely. Battery's all good. It's plummeting now quickly because I've got a. Oh no, that's the solar panel voltage. So battery voltage is steady at two point twelve point nine eight. So the charge is definitely powered. Plug it back in. Nope. The load has still not come on. Um, and I've tried crossing the the the. I've tried it so that. It crosses the voltage, the trigger voltage, and doesn't make any difference. It just does not work. So in here, we're in load output. That should be switching, switching on at 12.8 volts and off at 12.65, which I've had working on other chargers. So this one doesn't work. Let's check. Let's change it back to always on. I imagine it'll probably come on now. Well, maybe it won't. No, let's give it a couple of seconds because there can be a delay. I'm pretty sure it won't come on. So it's on always on. It's not the it's not the software, the software is saying off. Well that's feedback from the charger, I guess. Let's cycle the solar power again. It's set to always on, so that'll probably give it a few. Oh, I'm doing solar weirdly. Yep, there you go, and it works again. <laughs> 